Hey friends, if you know someone who is constantly hungry, drinks a lot of water, often goes to pee and has to take a shot every day, then unfortunately, that person may be suffering from a disease called diabetes mellitus. So, in today's episode, let us learn more about this condition and answer a critical question. What causes diabetes? Zoom in! Diabetes, also known as diabetes mellitus, means to pass through, is a disease that occurs when your blood glucose, a sugar that is the body's main source of fuel, is too high. But before we dig deeper into the subject of diabetes, First, we need to learn about a body organ called pancreas that is located right behind your stomach. It plays an essential role in converting the food we eat into fuel for the body cells and helps in the digestion process. Not only that, the pancreas has another important task in hand and that is regulating the amount of sugar in your blood with the help of hormones called insulin and glucagon that are produced in a special cell with a fancy name that is the islets of Langerhans. When you eat a heavy meal, the food is converted into glucose and enters your blood to be transported to your cells all over the body. So, the special cells in your pancreas sense this and release the insulin to help decrease blood sugar levels. It does this by activating a system that transports excess glucose from your blood into your cells, where it is used as energy fuel or saved for later use. On the other hand, if the level of blood sugar is low, the pancreas then releases another hormone called glucagon which tells the cells and liver to release the stored sugar back into the blood. And this is exactly how this long flat gland in your belly helps you maintain the level of sugar in your body. But in some cases, the pancreas doesn't work effectively and fails to produce adequate insulin, leading to a condition we call diabetes. Due to the lack of insulin, glucose stays in the blood and builds up, resulting in the hardening of blood vessels that can lead to multiple issues like strokes, heart attack or kidney failure. So, it's essential to spread awareness about diabetes that comes in different forms, namely type 1, type 2 and gestational diabetes. In type 1, your body does not create insulin as your immune system attacks and destroys the cells in your pancreas that produces it. In type 2, the pancreas cannot produce insulin as well or your body cannot use it effectively. And lastly, gestational diabetes develops in some women during pregnancy. Trivia time! Did you know, according to WHO, World Health Organization, about 422 million people worldwide have diabetes. Yes, diabetes affects 1 in 4 people over the age of 65, out of which about 90 to 95 percent of cases in adults are type 2 diabetes. Also, did you know that there are actually 5 types of diabetes? Yes. Apart from type 1, type 2 and gestational diabetes, two other less common types include monogenic diabetes, which is an inherited form of diabetes, and cystic fibrosis-related diabetes. It's question time! How many types of diabetes are there? Do write your answer in the comments section below and hit the like and subscribe button if you haven't yet to be a part of the Peekaboo Kids cutesy beautsy family and get a chance to get it featured by the end of our videos. So, here are the winners 
of the previous episode. Hope you enjoyed today's episode. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. Hey kids, you liked my videos, didn't you? Before you go, don't forget to click on the subscribe button and the bell so you won't miss out on my latest videos. <laughs> See you!